The poem that I analyzed is called To the Virgins to Make Much of Time by Robert Herrick. Gather ye rosebuds while ye may, old time is still a pouring, and the same flower that smiles today, tomorrow will be dying. The glorious lamp of heaven, the sun, the higher he's a getting. The sooner will his race be run, and nearer he's to setting. That age is best which is the first, when youth and blood are warmer, but being spent the worst and worst, times still succeed the former. Then be not coy, but use your time, and while you may, go marry, for having lost but once your prime, you may forever tarry. So from that poem, I was inspired to write my own poem because the words in this inspired me to use words of my own. So this is the poem that I wrote. Mom, can I be like you? I yearn for the numbers. At least grant me now the life at 32, or shall I just pass the time with slumbers? I don't wish to prioritize today. I sit and long for tomorrow. And the freedom that adults feel on a Saturday, that is the gold I chase at the end of my rainbow. Energetic beauty falls with speed. Absorb every eminence of your youth, as independence is the opposite of what you need. Only my experiences can reveal to you the truth. Upon your future, you only sit as a mourning dove. Feed your adolescence before the deadline. Embrace each second like it is everlasting love. My daughter, if only your age could be mine. So in this poem that I wrote, the first part is about me mentioning how I want to grow older. And as a young, a young woman, I always wanted to be older than I was. I always wanted the freedom that adults have. And in that first part, I state that. And in the second part is my mom telling me that I should live every moment of my youth like there's no tomorrow and to not want to grow up because once you're old you always want to be young so this poem's overall meaning is developed to portray that your youth is the best of your time so it's important to embrace every part of being young so the words that were used in the poem I translated into my own to say not to grow up. And when you grow old, there are not many opportunities provided to you. So wishing for youth away is only bringing you damage. And I was inspired by this poem because it correlates to conversations I've had with my grandmother and mother in the past about wanting to grow up. And they have told me to keep on living while I'm young because there's no other time like that and the best opportunities come when you're young especially love as it is mentioned in the poem your best time to receive love is when you are young as you grow older there are not many opportunities and you may be hoping for the opportunity when you're older and never receive that opportunity so only live while you're young.